Greetings, my name is Snakeface, and welcome to Don't Starve. Now, I do have the Reign of Giants edition, and it says it here, but I'm not going to be playing the Reign of Giants edition. I'm going to try the normal Don't Starve, which you can just disable it here when you go to start a new game, pretty much. Because I've never played the normal Don't Starve, I've only played the Reign of Giants. So it's tough. Also, is that how it says it? How you say it? Is that even what that word is? Rain? I'm not too sure. But the only thing I know about the normal Don't Starve experience is that it's mainly about the seasons, how there's only summer and winter, and you don't burn to death or freeze to death <laughs> in each of those seasons. So we're going to try it without Rain of Giants on. I'll use this character. Who is this character? Wilson. I have pretty much every character except for two unlocked, but I'll play with the first one. And that's also the only one I've played with. I might also make it a huge size world, just so I can play for longer on the world. And also, since when you when you're in a huge world, it's full you end up playing for a lot longer, but it's also hard to find things, which is another thing. I might try a huge, though. I will play those settings. Yeah, okay. Let's start a new world. New game. New world. Whatever it is. And here we are. Say, pal, you don't look so good. You'd better find something to eat before night comes. Yes, but we should also find, um... What do we need for a campfire? Wood and glass. That's not much. Uh, should I get flowers? Flowers increase your uh, sanity, which mine is fine at the moment. So first I need uh, sticks and um, what else do I need to make an axe? Flint. Which I'm not sure where to find that. Well, it means on the ground, but I don't know where. Probably appears randomly somewhere. Oh yeah, there it is. And I can make an axe already. Let's go chop down the trees. Hmm. Lots of flowers around as well. Wood. We also need wood for the actual campfire to keep the fire going. So we need to get quite a lot of wood. Hmm. And I can already make one. I've only just started the world. Today, today you always seem to go pretty quick in this as well. Like, this feels like you don't have much time. And I think this starting season was summer too. Um, also, I can eat, we can eat seeds. I don't think we will eat them just yet. Let's build a campfire now. I'm not going to place it all. Just build it. And. After the campfire, you should probably build a science machine, which you need rocks and I need rocks and gold for. Rocks you get from um, st stones. Oh, this beefalo. It's like a buffalo, but it's with beef. I guess it's a buffalo, but with a different name. So like it just got dark for the for a second there. I don't know, I thought it just got dark. But it could have been just me changing going into the other biome. Yeah. I can't make any other tools yet. Because I need more flint. And I don't have any more flint yet. My axe is about to break. And it's broken now. But I got something from that. I need flint from somewhere. There's the map, I guess. Map. map isn't too useful yet, since we haven't really explored much. 
So let's go over here and pick up lots of manure along the way. Because that can be used to regrow grass. And there's stick trees. The things that you get sticks from. Twigs. I don't know what they're called exactly, so I'll just call them stick trees. Getting more grass and manure. There's not too much around here. Thought a bird. There's flowers over there. I don't think I'll get flowers yet, because when you pick flowers, your sanity does go up, which is a good thing. And so I think I'll only get it when I need to, so my sanity actually goes up when I pick get the flowers. Also, it's getting dark now. It looks very red. Yeah, it looks very red in this plains biome. And my sanity is starting to go down now, since it's dark. It's not fully night time though. Yeah. What is this over here? There's a skeleton there. And this rope. I think rope is useful for when you go underground sometime. What's oh, so there's a trap there? Better him than me. Yeah, the skeleton here there, with his head in the ground. I have no clue how he got like that, but his head is in the ground. It's green mushroom. What is green mushroom used for? Something good, I think, but you can eat it. Hmm. Should I get that trap? You can get bunnies, catch bunnies with that. I might leave it where it is for now. I can always come back to it and you can see it on your map. Oh wow, I've travelled quite a, quite a bit. Although it's probably not much compared to the world size. Because I did select huge. Which I actually have no clue how big it actually is. I've never explored the whole world on huge. I need to place my campfire soon. So this is about to be night time. Lots of crows. Yeah. These paths here sometimes lead to somewhere. But then they don't always lead to somewhere. I'm always not too sure if I should follow them or not. Usually I just ignore them. I should place my campfire now. Um, maybe right here. Okay, it's about to be night time. And we'll add fuel. The fire's getting out of hand apparently. Uh, let's eat seeds. Wait, we could have cooked them. Whoops. And I'll... Yeah, I'll cook this. Green cap. From the mushroom. Because when they're cooked, I think you're... That did not increase my hunger. It increased my sanity, but also made my health go down. By like one, I think. Which is fine. It gets ultra dark at night. The only light that is created is from the campfire. And it's very blue light for some reason. But everything like outside the area of the campfire is pitch black. I'll have some more seeds here. That's good. I can cook them and eat them. That makes my health and food go up. And your food goes down quite quickly, but it's still... A bit unrealistic, I guess, because in like, in real life, your f hunger would probably go down faster. Maybe? I don't know. I'm comparing a game that is very unrealistic to real life. So, so, another thing that I know with this normal version and Reign of Giants that... Oh wow. Is that it's um, a lot easier. It's so like the normal version seems a lot more like a casual survival game. A bit like how Minecraft is and Frame of Giants is more like intense survival. Nice and comfy. 
Uh, am I able to craft another one? Yeah, I'll have tons of wood and glass. That's good. Saving. There we go. I need more flint. I don't have any more flint yet. Let's zoom in. There we go. Because I need to make another axe. And probably a pickaxe. Probably a pickaxe as well. Oh, there's a bunny there. Wow. I'm slow over there. Which should be useful ish. My sanity is almost at full still, anyway. I'm getting tons of glass. I have 37 glass. I don't know if I'd need this much glass, but I'm getting this all of this glass. It should be useful anyway. Well, hopefully it's useful. Ah, there's a berry bush over there. For food. That's a green mushroom. It's the... Oh, the green mushroom is sleeping? How do mushrooms sleep? Was well, that tree over there just grew a bit? It's really weird how you can see them grow a bit. There's a wormhole. I don't know if I want to jump in the wormhole. Wormhole like teleports you to a different place in the map. But I think I'll only use it if I really need it. Because your sanity does go down when you go through it, but I'm not sure how much. I'll get some more sticks. Oh, it's a sapling. That's what they're called. I, well, we can make something in here. Oh, glass suit. That's, used, that's a bit of armor. Kind of. It's glass. Quite a small amount of protection. I mean, it probably provides hardly any protection. Like, it is just glass. Well, literally just wearing glass. I think it was sticks as well to hold it together. I'll get another flower. <laughs> the bunnies scream whenever you go near them. I mean, it is really quiet, but still, they do scream. My hunger is getting quite low as well. Why does it sound like it's raining? Because I see no rain. It's not raining. Was it the sound of rain that I heard? I thought I heard raining. That energy is at full now. My sanity is at full. Get some more glass. That's a red bird. And there's cove. More glass. I really don't think I need much more glass. Because I have 50 glass already. I'm going to stop getting glass. Oh, I'm really hungry now. Oh, so what does eating petals do? I think that makes your hunger go up by one. Which is not much. There's uh, the sea here. Which in this version, this normal version, you can't really do anything at the sea. Well, I don't think you can. That's from what I know. I don't think you can. Because I'm just going back to near where I was before with this sea. Oh no, there's a bit of a corner here where I can go down here. Okay. I don't know why I'm following the water. Uh, it's about to go a bit dark. There's no flint or anything around here in these biomes, so sometimes the, it's getting late or be darker soon. And I'm ultra hungry. 50 hunger. I sh should I place a campfire yet and cook food? Maybe not just yet, maybe get, when it gets a bit more towards night time. But not too much because of my hunger. I don't want to cook the food before I eat it, so it, I think it cooking it fills me up more. More, I think it does. <laughs> you can zoom out so much that you see clouds, which is really weird. But I mean, that's that's fine. But it just puts you back, it puts the camera back. You can also zoom in really far. 
I, mean, I don't know why I'm saying this. It's just a thing in the game. I'll get some more petals. 41 hunger. Oh, there's a spider, two spiders over there. And a spider den. Which is pretty much a spider nest. I'll stay away from there for now. So I have nothing to attack. What's the path here? I'm going near where I was before now. <laughs> yeah. Um, maybe if it, uh, there's just that biome again. Because I want to try and find Flint, so I want to stay in, like, try and stay away from this biome over here a little bit. Except I'm, like, surrounded by it. Which is quite annoying. I went a lot. I went, went a lot faster when I'm on paths. Is that the same wormholes as before? Yes. There's more seeds. It seems like seeds just appear randomly. At places, I should place a campfire now. Okay, it's about to go dark. There we go. Um, I'll use pine cones. For the fuel. There we go. So I don't have to waste wood. Because I do use wood quite a bit. I'll cook the berries. Does that do much? I'm not sure. It probably did something though. And I'll eat the seeds. I'll probably eat the petals too. Okay, eating pe petals does nothing. There's seeds as well. Wow, oh, the fire's really small, okay. I was wondering why it wasn't making much light there. Like before the camp, when the campfire was at its like medium fire stage, like that, it was, was creating a lot more light before when I had the campfire. Using pine cones makes it go um, makes the fire go out a lot quicker as well. And I used all my pine cones, and I had like eleven to start off with. Worlds one, can you rename worlds? I'm not sure. It's, it says world one up here when I put the mouse over the clock. I don't know why. But it does, I guess. I'm still really hungry, so I still have to find food. Hmm. I'm also thinking of maybe going in that wormhole. Because if you're here, it seems like that there's only going to be that grass area. And probably around here as well. So I might try going through that wormhole. When it comes daytime, which is like probably in a few seconds, I think. Oh, that's more seeds. There you go, more seeds. Oh, I have two seeds. What did I get the other seed? I'm not sure. Okay, um, I'm gonna go through the wormhole. And where do we come out? Uh, in this place. Oh. <laughs> well, maybe that was a slight waste. So I'm just back to pretty much right next to where I spawned. Oh, that didn't do too much. My sanity didn't go down too much, which is good. Yes, I'm really hungry. I knew that. There's carrots. Cool. Oh, did I pick up... Was there flint back here? I'm not sure. Uh, no? No, there's no flint. Okay. Yeah, there's sticks though. Saplings. That I can get tweaks from. And I can craft a trap now. And another glass suit. Which I don't really need. Also, I can make a torch. 
Torches are good, but they don't really last long. But at least you can actually walk around in the darkness with them. We can hear the wind. Like the air. Spiderflies, I think. Yeah, it's a butterfly. That is where, here's where I was chopping it down the trees before. There's more flint. Do I just need one? Yeah, I just need one. For the axe. No. Make the axe, please. There we go. How hungry am I? 38 hunger. Huh, should I chop down more trees now? Ah, uh, probably. I have 10 wood left, so that'll be a good idea. I probably should try to make a f um, science machine as well, which I need golden rocks for. But I haven't really found any rocks with gold in them. Which you can actually see, like there's... You can actually see if there's gold in them when you find a rock. So you don't have to like dig into it to find gold. Well, I mean you do have to get dig into it to get the gold, of course. But just to see if it does have gold. What's the days going for longer now? Yeah. Yeah, the time of the amount of daylight there is and. Nighttime changes depending on the season and what, how far you are through the season. And I'm about to starve. And the point of this game is to not starve. So I should cook food and eat. I have quite a bit of food, I think. I have three carrots and two seeds I can cook to eat. But there you go. I had three carrots and two seeds. There we go. My hunger is a lot better. I'm a lot more full now. Which is good. Okay, is there any more flint? There's some flint down there. And it's also raining. Alright, is it? I think when it rains, if you get too wet, your sanity starts going down from the water. So I don't think it's too much of a problem just yet. Because my sanity is really high. I was going to make an axe. Yes. I want to make an axe. So I can break rocks. Uh, where was the... Was there one around here? Oh, there's one all the way over there. And there's ones out here. There's not really any rocks around here. I'll go down this way to get that rock. So I can get stone. I think it's called... Or is it just called rock? It's just called rocks. I'll mine the rock to get rock. I mean, that makes sense. <laughs> There's a pig guy over there. Oh wait, we got... Do we get gold from that? Oh, it's nitro. Nitro? What is this? There's these pig guys, which... They're, they're pig guys. And they seem to be... Uh, defending very bushes. They're really easy to run away from. There are lots of very bushes there. I'll leave them for now. I guess. Right, can you stop chasing me? I'm going to leave you alone. There you go. Right, you can stop chasing me now. I'll get this berry bush over here. My inventory is full already. Oh, yeah, I can't carry in more stuff. Um, should I get rid of something? I don't know. Maybe not. What are you burning? 
Oh, you just have those torches, okay. <laughs> it sounded like you were, like, burning the dead berries or something. Like, campfire. And then we'll pick up... So I'll cook the carrot. Then eat it. No, eat it. There we go. To eat the seeds. And I'll eat the berries. There we go. And I guess I'll get this a lot of the stuff around me right now. Like there's lots of trees and grass around the campfire. And it's more food, which is good. Because I still need more food. Cook the food and eat it. No. Eat it. There we go. Must defend. <laughs> I don't even know your berry bushes anymore. Well, I mean, I am quite close to them, but... Not too close, I guess. <laughs> nice and comfy. No. <laughs> I don't want to drop the locks. Put in more fuel. There we go. There's some more seeds. I'll cook and eat the seeds. 90 health, that's good. No, no. I shouldn't have gone near there. But I, need, I want that flower. I'll get that flower quickly. Ugh, didn't punch me. There we go. Uh, there's also the twig I can get. Defend. <laughs> okay, it's just about daytime. Nighttime does not last long, which is good because you can't really, you can hardly really do anything at nighttime. There's a bit of land over here. I have to find like a bit of a crossing. Here you see having. Ah, uh, it's not that way. Well, there, is there anything special over there? There's berries and flint. Oh, right here. There's also a gravestone there, which we can get gold from. Just lying around randomly, we can find gold. Uh, now it just needs more stone. Which there's... Well, rocks. Which is rocks there. And I can make a science machine. But I'm not sure where about I should put it. Because usually, like... Us usually the um, science machine becomes like the place of your home base, pretty much. And you can actually see it on the map and use it as your home base. But I'm just not too sure where exactly I should put it. I'm thinking maybe around here. Because up here might not be a good idea because of the gravestones. And there are ghosts that can come out. Others over here. Maybe down there. So, somewhere. Maybe down here. And I'll get these berries while I'm over here. Five flint, that's good. I can make another axe. There we go, because I do need another axe. That fire is lasting a long time. Well, see, I don't think you need that with those torches on anymore. Because it's not dark. It's quite light. I'm up here, I was thinking. Maybe here? Around here might be a good place. Maybe. Oh, it's because of the place that I'm in. 
If you chop down too many trees, these trees can come to life and attack you for, for chopping down too many trees. It's like the teachers, the game teaches you to try and be environment friendly. Um, I think I might place it here. I don't know if this is good. Is it a good place or not? Maybe up there a bit. Up here. Maybe right here, yeah. But then you get more things to craft. I don't think I mentioned that. You get more things to craft. Like tons of new things. Like a shovel. And a pitchfork. And a razor. I have no clue what that sound was. Don't know if you heard it, but I heard some kind of fiery sound. I need to make a fire pit as well. Which is like a campfire, but it doesn't despawn. Like with the other um, campfires I was making, they always despawn, so you have to keep on making them. With these ones, you need 12 rocks for them. But they always stay in the one place, which is good. So where could I find more rocks? Probably up here, somewhere. I'll get out my axe. A uh, pickaxe. I, I always call a pickaxe an axe. There's more berries as well. And more flint. Which is really useful. Oh, I'm really... I have 50 hunger. 50 food, whatever you want to call that. My stomach is 50. <laughs> Well, apparently my name is on that gravestone. That's uh, apparently that's my name. That's really creepy. Also, this is what the the um rocks look like when they have gold in them. You can just see a bit of yellow for the gold. They don't have too much gold. Like, well, they have two gold, which is really useful. Uh, how many works do we have? We have five. And now we have eight, I think. It looks really fuzzy. Because I have the pixels on pretty low. More sticks and flint. I can't make it that can't find it. I need two more rocks, which I can get from this very quickly. There we go. And more nitrate. I'm not too sure what that is used for. And I'll go over back to my science machine. There's more seeds though. I want more seeds. Hmm. Thirty-four hunger. Am I going to get back in time? I hope so. Oh wait, I can... Yeah, that's right, I can make that now. The fire pit. <sighs> Maybe that was a bad place to put it, because there's... There's not really too mu much play resources around me that I need. Like, there's no... Well, I mean, the rocks in gold are quite close. I mean, it's not like they're over here or something. Not like I have to travel for days. Hmm. Also, the more I travel, it would be probably better to maybe set up multiple bases. Maybe. I haven't set up multiple bases before. Hmm. So that might be a good idea to do. Oh, 25 hunger. I need to eat. Eat the berries and the seeds. There we go. 
And uh, what else could I make? I could make a razor, but I don't need to do that yet. There's pitchforks. Wait, you can plant seeds, can't you? I've never done that in this game, but I, you, I'm pretty sure you can plant seeds. Hmm. Also, after you actually make it, you can. You don't have to be near the. After you've made it once, you don't have to be near the science machine to make it a second time, which is quite good. Um, so a shovel would probably be good. So I can actually dig up the tree stumps. There's a, another seed. I might put the grass. It should be fine to drop things around here, since this is going to be one of my bases. Reason not yet. I don't think I'll make anything else. I don't really need a torch. I can make a trap. What's this? Oh, backpack. They're quite good, but they also... I can't have my um, armor there. My grass suit. Although it is just grass. Uh, what would be better? Um, I might make a backpack. For now, at least. Okay, I might have my backpack. Oh, so I'll my grass suit go. It's right there. I might drop that. Oh yeah, I might keep that there. As a basic farm to grow seeds. That would be a good idea. Yes, where should we put it? I'm not sure. I don't know if it matters too much. Well, that looks really weird. That's a farm. Okay. Um. Maybe just up here. I think. Oh, okay, here we go. Now we use a... Wait. Okay, so I th think... We just get a seed. And then we plant it. Ah, there we go. Okay, cool. So we're up to day five at the moment. And I'm still really hungry. It's going so slowly. I have seeds growing now. What I haven't, actually haven't done before in this game. I haven't grown anything. And it's probably a good idea to grow stuff. So I don't have to keep on exploring and going out to try and find food. So I'm going to leave this video here. Uh, thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, then please leave a like. And subscribe if you want to see more videos from me. And comment down below in the comment section if you have something to say. Thank you for watching this video and I will see you in the next video. Bye!